moving day. We did it. So we are officially moving tomorrow, you guys. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you. We're feeling hella discouraged. As you guys saw in our last vlog, it ended off by finding out that our brand new fridge our second brand new fridge. They already had one that wasn't working, so they brought in another one. It's also not working. So this is our new fridge, which is a huge upgrade from what we have right now. I just wanna make sure it's... Yo, babe. C'est pas froid du tout. Actually? At all. No. The fridge like turns on and there's like the light works in the fridge and you can hear it like the fridge is on but for whatever reason they're not getting cold. So um, we don't have a fridge and I doubt it's going to get resolved today so we're asking like Alex's sister and then I'm going to ask my parents to bring back some of our food because like I said we literally we literally don't we don't have a fridge and I, like I said I highly doubt it's going to get resolved today unfortunately. So <laughs> Like literally, I am on the verge of having a meltdown on top of all the stress of moving. It's like, and it's like the fridge, like it had to be the fridge. Like it couldn't have been, you know, the, 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 the dishwasher or the washer and dryer or even like the stove. The stove even would have been better. Like the fridge is just like, what are we gonna eat? Like I literally can't have my morning coffee because I put milk in my coffee. So we're literally gonna have to order out for like everything. I'm gonna have to go get coffee out and you know, breakfast. I think we can scramble with stuff we have in the pantry. Um, but for dinner, it's like, what, what do you have for dinner that's like not in the fridge? Like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Like that's a lunch. But anyway, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to figure it out. So, um, so that's where we're at right now. Alex is working all day today. So my mom and my sister are coming again. They weren't supposed to, but I think they like, saw that i was literally on the verge of having a meltdown so they're gonna help me today we're gonna move the bar cart our nightstands and basically extra stuff that's not going in the truck we're just gonna like move everything over today and get it all done and and then tomorrow's the big moving day so um you guys won't really be seeing much of the moving process just because i'm not gonna be filming like Alex's friends and family and also that I have to be at the apartment between 7 30 and noon for the wi-fi so I actually won't be like helping with the moving process at all so um with that being said I'll try and get snippets of today but it's pretty much just going to be like what you guys have been seeing like just us kind of like trying to organize everything so so this is our makeshift bed we slept on this last night. This is what my dad did yesterday. That's part of our bed base. Um, and then the mirror is all wrapped up here. Then we also took apart our beautiful kitchen table, which we will obviously be bringing. And this is kind of what this area is looking like. And we're slowly starting to get rid of stuff in the kitchen also. in the morning and my mom is on her way we're gonna head to the new apartment and wait for the Wi-Fi people person to come for Videotron to arrive and I'm just saying goodbye to the old place we're gonna miss it here one eternity later all right guys moving day we did it um, it's five o'clock now. I did not vlog any of the process because it was completely chaotic, but we got everything in. We are completely moved in. Obviously, there's boxes everywhere, but I'll just give you guys kind of like a little sneak peek of what we're working with here. So this is going to be my office space. So right now we kind of have like 
a start. Like we have all our jackets here and then some more storage and we got like our Christmas tree up there and more empty boxes. And then my desk is here. We haven't set up any of the computer stuff yet. And then there's just like, oh my, there's so many boxes here. My office chair. Um, and then Alex has his monitors here and his old desk. We're getting rid of this, I think. Um, and then this is like the only like somewhat put together section, which is the living room. So we kind of have like a vague idea of how it's going to be laid out. We're probably going to keep this chair here. And then we're obviously, like I told you guys, we're getting a sectional. So for now we're using Alex's, um, just sofa for the time being, but that'll go in his office eventually. And then we have our little nook. This is my favorite part of the apartment. This is what sold me little Timothée. Just chilling there in his new spot. He likes the new home. And um, yeah, this is this is what it looks like. And then we have obviously like the media unit with my little pampas grass. And we have not put any of the decor pieces up yet. It is the first morning in the new apartment. Well, I mean officially yesterday morning. I was obviously here with my mom super early, but it's the first official night that we obviously slept in the apartment and that we're waking up in the apartment. So we have no curtains. Our curtains did not come in and we did not find like a decent rod um, to purchase. So we weren't able to put them up yesterday. So at like seven in the morning, the sun woke me up. It was like beaming in in the bedroom because it gets so bright in there early in the morning. Sorry, Alex is building his desk. Um, anyway, so I was like in and out of sleep for a while, but I was exhausted, you guys. I literally got out of bed around 9.30, I think, which it's been a hot minute since I stayed in bed that late. So um, today is literally just going to be an unpacking day. Um, I have meetings tomorrow, so we need to get like our computer set up all done. Alex is working on his and then and then he'll do mine. Um, and just like emptying as many boxes as we can, which is not too, too exciting. Um, but we really like are not sure where a lot of things are going. So it's going to be a little bit of a, um, you know, just put stuff for the time being sort of situation. Um, because we still are probably going to be getting rid of some furniture. Um, like the entrance table and my, potentially my desk as well. So we'll see, we'll see what happens. And for the time being, I'm just going to scroll on my phone because I feel like I have not been updated on what's happening in the real world for a while. And I'm just going to sip on my coffee because I'm exhausted. I'm still so freaking tired. I feel like. I feel like I could pass out again right now. So it's gonna be like a multiple coffee sort of day. I don't know, I don't know if it's my allergies or what, but like my nose is like leaking and I feel like I sound like I'm sick. But I'm not, I swear. So cheers. Good morning guys. Sorry for not updating more yesterday. Um, I was exhausted and not even feeling well it was just not a good day but i'm feeling much better this morning and hopefully it will stay this way um today's a big day i have two meetings today so we had our we got our computer set up all set up i'm going to show you guys in a second and also we have our new fridge being delivered today so hopefully this one will work you guys saw in the last vlog that um we were delivered two new fridges literally in a row and neither of them were working they weren't getting cold so this one apparently like they confirmed it works so hopefully we'll have a fridge today because we've literally stored all our food at our parent at my parents place like they came they picked up and like they're storing our food i apologize for my hair by the way i need to shower today um 
and yeah so the game plan is i'm gonna have one meeting um back to back and then i'm going to shower and hopefully then the fridge guys will come they're going to come between 10 30 and 2 30 i believe so that's the game plan for today you guys and i'm gonna show you kind of what we have going on but also we're gonna switch things up well i'm gonna switch things up in my office like it's not gonna stay that way um yeah and then i also need to pick up coffee because my mom brought a cooler with like milk and it lasted yesterday morning like i it was still really cold yesterday but this morning it's like completely done so i need to go pick up coffee i can't have black coffee i'm i'm not that tough so i need my milk and my sugar um and we don't have milk so i need to oh but if i pick up a milk hopefully okay maybe that's what i'll do Hopefully they'll come like early-ish that like I can go because there's an IGA literally two seconds from us. So maybe I'll just go pick up a milk. Maybe I could do that. All right, we'll see. We'll see. So here is my office setup for the time being. So it's still pretty dark, you guys. It's a gloomy day. Um, and this room only really gets light in the afternoon. Um, so this is my office setup right now. I have it so that when I'm like on my calls, you guys, I get like the brick wall in the back, but I'm not going to keep it this way. It's the same setup as at the other apartment. So I just ordered yesterday a very simple, like I ordered a corner desk. I don't know if that's like the right term, but it's like an L corner desk. So I'm going to have it come, come all here and then it's going to go here and it's going to stick out a little bit like it is right now, but just a pinch. And I got it in white. So it's kind of, kind of brighten the room. Um, and then I'll have my monitors on this side and then my laptop here because right now my laptop does not fit on this. And then I'll get a filing cabinet because the, the desk that I got doesn't have any drawers. It's really just plain. And I'll be able to put um, all the files that I have in the drawers here um, in the filing cabinet. And then what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to get like a custom made wardrobe kind of to go in this corner just so that I can store all my shoes and sunglasses and bags and stuff like that um just to kind of get as much as i can stored here i think what i'm gonna do i'm not 100 percent sure yet is i'm gonna get just like a small couch for here and then i'll put like a little coffee table here um just to have like a little place to chill but i'm not 100 percent certain about that yet so we'll see so that's the rough game plan for the office um and i'll show you guys alex's office as well because he literally got his whole setup up but he's still sleeping so i'm gonna try and be really quiet so he kind of did the same thing where and those he needs to hang up on the walls but he did the same setup kind of where it's like the brick wall is the background and his monitors are like facing the door you know and then he has this he's the balcony in his room kind of like the other apartment gloomy day and then he'll he'll have his couch here that's where um in the lit the one we're using in the living room right now that's actually his so this couch will go back in his room this is his old desk we're gonna sell it on facebook marketplace um as well as with mine because mine's coming on friday so pretty quickly so this will go back in his office and that's the update you guys that is um what we have right now yesterday was really like getting our computers up um because you guys know that alice is working today and, and so am i um and then i did a little bit of work like unboxing some more stuff so we have like the record player here then I started to like decorate the media unit again and store stuff in the drawers. Um, and then I got some more trinket stuff here out, but there's still a lot of work to be done. So that'll obviously be continued today. So I'm all showered and dressed and I'm just gonna go pick up a coffee. Um, literally just down the street, my hair is still wet. So, and I feel like it's gonna dry super poofy because it's so humid out. I'm just gonna vlog on my phone because my camera's charging. So let's go grab a coffee. <laughs> Here we 
here's a little OOTD, excuse the mess. You guys know I have my frizzy freaking hair. And the entire fit is Veramoda. I'm sorry for the train, the window is open and you guys can see it. We like literally moved to a new home with a train also. We had a train at the other place too. But yeah, the whole fit is Veramoda and I'm actually shooting a campaign for them this weekend, which I'm really excited about. So here's a sneak peek. It's really cute. Very like Victorian, very fitting with the apartment. And I just thought I'd get a little dressed up because I've literally looked like a bum for the past like three weeks. Like I have not put a drop of makeup on and I just wanted to look kind of cute today. So that's the fit. So the goal today is to find a dresser. Um, we really need one because right now pretty much all the clothes that we're not hanging up in the closet are in boxes and that's like the bulk. Well, Alex's shirts are all hung up. Like he pretty much all his shirts, actually I think every single one he hangs up. Obviously I have a lot more clothes than him and I need like storage. So we decided not to do the custom made Ikea thing just because of the way like the closets are styled. It would just be too difficult. So I think what, well not I think, what we're, we've decided to do is we're actually going to get rid of our entrance table and we're going to put a dresser there. So that's what we've decided to do and um i need to we need to get on that asap like we need to and plus delivery takes like forever oftentimes so we need to get on that we need to find our dresser because it could take several weeks to get here um yeah so so far i've ordered my desk which i told you guys about this morning and i will update you guys on tomorrow actually tomorrow's friday right yeah i think so so tomorrow it's coming and then we ordered the rod for our curtains which should arrive tomorrow as well and the curtains should arrive um, today. So, so yeah, so we're, we're slowly puzzling this apartment together and it's gonna take some time, but we just wanna remove as many boxes as we can. This is the temporary fridge. It's not new, um, but they're just gonna give us this. They know for a fact this one's functioning, so they're gonna give us this one until our other one is repaired. And we're hoping that like this one works because if it doesn't, then it's an electrical problem with the outlet. So we're gonna have to figure that out. And that will obviously take longer and we're gonna have to go even longer without a fridge, which just sucks. So you guys can see there's like marks on it and stuff. So we have to wait five hours before we can plug it in. So that's what we're gonna do. And I'm so freaking hopeful that it works because we need a fridge, we need a fridge. Like me, it's for coffee in the morning more than food. <laughs> I need milk in my coffee and I don't wanna have to spend like $5 on a coffee every time, every morning. If any of you guys know like good dupes, for the cloud couch, the restoration hardware cloud couch. Sorry for the watery eyes, I'm like having a coughing fit. But yeah, that's not going to completely break the bank. Ideally between like 2.5, well even less is like bonus, but we really don't really wanna go above 4.5 grand. And even that's like a hard max um, before tax. So yeah, that's like what we'd prefer if we have to spend a little more. I mean, I guess it's not the end of the world, but we really want like couch that we want we don't want to buy like another crap box like we really want to invest in a good couch that's going to last us a few years um so yeah if you guys know any good dupes for the cloud couch um in canada though like we don't want to order from a u.s website because then you're gonna have to pay like extreme you know duties on a couple thousand dollar couch which is just not going to be fun so it needs to be based in canada if you guys have any suggestions um, I know a lot of them are like sold out right now. My new desk came in. So I'm going to attempt to build that now and put it in the corner.
good morning friends so this vlog's a little bit all over the place um i apologize for my little hair thing i uh, was doing my makeup and i still need to straighten my hair but i want to talk to you guys because i this vlog has kind of been kind of wonky i've I don't know since we've moved in i just feel like i'm in a daze i feel like i'm on vacation i don't know i just i feel very out of it very off um i guess it's like me just trying to like adapt to the new place um i don't know alex and i are like we feel like we're on vacation especially with like our new location we're out every night we're going to the canal we're eating out um yeah, so last off, I believe I showed you guys that our fridge was delivered. So it works. Yay, it works. We're so happy. So um, all our food is stored at my parents' place. So I believe today, actually, I'm um, going to bring it over just to, so that we can bring some food over and not have to order out again. Um, so that that's priority number one today. I also need to shoot a campaign today with Veramoda, which... I'm super excited about it's been in the works for like a month and a half this project and um, it's it's obviously had to come to realization and be due the week that I moved so um, I just I have not had any time to, to obviously go out and shoot any looks so today the whole day is dedicated to that so it's a full day of work also you guys saw that I was building my desk and I struggled in half but it's ready I'm really really happy with it I think this is like the optimal setup for this um, layout of the office and I think it's very minimal it still leaves the room open and at the same time like you get the brick wall on the back i think it's really really pretty and also gives me a lot more space so the issue originally was that the desk that i had the strict tube one which is back there um which i'm now putting for sale on marketplace um it was great but it just was not big enough so i have three screens i have um my two monitors like my mac and an extra monitor and i have my um, laptop as well so on my old desk i barely had enough room for like my pens and then like my agenda and then my laptop just did not fit so with this setup i have everything laid out and then some i have even more room so i'll be able to put like put my coffee there no problem in the mornings and i'll have lots of room to eat if i'm eating while i'm working um as well as having that extra space for some decor items which i'm really happy about so adding like a fresh vase of flowers on there like just to like add some color so i'm really happy about that because i've always wanted a really nice working situation like a work desk situation and i think this was optimal i will link the desk down below it's a piece of crap fair warning um i paid the 200 dollars or something for it um i didn't want something super expensive my equipment is where i want to put my money and not so much the desk i know it's kind of like well just buy like a good quality desk but to be honest i just wanted something minimal and this does the job so it's definitely flimsy but it's strong enough to hold everything that i need it to hold and um and yeah and it looks pretty so that's really all i care about so for the next few years that's where i'll be working when we move who knows but for now this is what i'm going to be sticking with good morning you guys so today i'm gonna be trying to do as much work as possible i've got my coffee here it's an ice chai kind of day because we have a heat warning coming here in montreal the next few days i think it's gonna be like close to 35 degrees the next three days which is like ugh. but anyway we don't have ac yet because the electrician has not come so we're making do so far like this apartment is it doesn't heat up too too much especially this room that i'm in as you guys know by now it's not too bright yet like the window is all the way over there so in the afternoon light comes in but it's it's not like too heavy and i want to show you guys also updates that we have done in the apartment so i mean there's a lot less boxes but there's still a lot we have all these boxes left and a lot of this i won't be able to clean up until um i get i'm gonna get like an ikea kind of unit that i'm gonna put here for all my shoes bags and accessories so you guys saw in the last apartment i had like an accessories closet um so that's what i'm gonna buy so basically i'm just gonna recreate like the accessories closet that i had at the other apartment 
um, like fully just gonna like recreate it because it was great. It fit all my shoes. I thought I wanted to do like a shoe wall up here, but I just, my shoes aren't clean enough, I think, to like display them like that. And I only really have like three pairs of like nice shoes, like expensive, nice designer or just like, you know, real leather or whatever shoes. So yeah, I don't think it's, I don't think it's worth putting up a whole shoe wall. And I'll also show you the fireplace mantle that we purchased that we're gonna put in the bedroom, we think. So that'll be really nice because right now it's pretty plain in there. And I'll show you guys, I there's still a whole bunch of like that box over there is empty. Believe it or not, it's better than it was. We are getting rid of this table and we're gonna get a dresser. We're just gonna get pretty much the same one that we had at the other apartment, um, but it's gonna be horizontal so I'll insert a photo of what we're getting and then we're gonna like change the handles just to make it a little more bougie because you guys know Ikea dressers are like very simple and plain but we really need the space like that's the main priority so that's what we're gonna focus on dressers can also get really expensive so we'd rather just buy one that's cheaper but no it does the job than to like invest in one that like we might not even keep when we buy a place um, and then that's obviously the really pretty circuit mirror, which we have not taken out because it doesn't have a place right now But it'll probably go either over top of the dresser or over top of the fireplace mantle. I'm not too sure yet This is all clothes. So that's my clothes Alex's clothes. This is more of my clothes This is stuff that doesn't have a place yet, but bathroom stuff plus two hats and the kitchen made really good progress It's pretty much all set up now um, These are empty and that's garbage and we need to get rid of this we don't need this so if someone wants it come claim it and then this i just need to put away and then we need to find a place for this which is like i know it looks like trash but they're like the presents like you know like you have like that drawer in your house with all like extra like gift bags when you like have a gift to give or like christmas presents or birthday presents so all the bags and stuff are in there plus a few extra like just plastic bags so that's the update. We got lots done, but still have quite a bit to do. That's okay, it's slow moving, but we're getting there. And oh, I organized the entire bar cart also. So I know it's like kind of hard to see right now, but it's pretty much the same setup as the other apartment. Just more organized and the glass is a lot more clean. This clip is being taken a few days later. Um, I just wanted to end the vlog here, you guys. Um, like I said, this vlog was very sporadic and a little bit all over the place, but I hope you guys kind of got the gist of where we're at right now um, with just the apartment and everything. Obviously, it's still in the really early stages. There's definitely gonna be more updated vlogs on the way. Um, definitely not anytime soon. Like the next updates are gonna be probably minimum like a month from now just because we've started to order furniture we now need to wait for the furniture to come in um and so when that stuff starts to come in and once we're able to actually start like decorating the apartment properly i will obviously update you guys with that but it's definitely going to be like a slow moving process i asked in my instagram stories if you guys preferred longer vlogs or shorter vlogs and the majority of you said longer vlogs so i'm just going to do it this way where it's um, kind of like my first vlog where I'll start, you know, if something comes in tomorrow, I'll vlog it, but then I won't actually post it until maybe like a month, a month and a half from now. I'm active on my Instagram stories, so if you have just stumbled on my video, be sure to go follow me on Instagram um, for more updates and for more um, just like apartment content because I'm obviously going to be active on there as well. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you for being a part of this journey with Alex and I, and I will see you guys next time with another new video. Bye.